don't turn your back on the wolf pack. Or do, if it suits your playstyle. Hi, I'm Mario from TTPM, and today we're talking about The Game of Wolf by Grey Matter Games. If you're a fan of trivia games and collectibles, be sure to subscribe to our channel for reviews of new and upcoming releases. Designed for ages 14 and up, and suggested right, for groups of 4 to 12 people, top toys. the game includes 250 question cards, a scoreboard, two answer boards, three dry erase markers, and instructions. This game is one part quiz game and one part trust exercise, as the game forces players to either remain loyal to their chosen pack or go it alone for extra points. Fill in the blank of the most popular holiday toys from years past. Number one, tickle me. Each game lasts for three rounds, which revolves around a circuit of everyone having at least one turn as the wolf Nintendo until blank. it returns to the original player. Gameplay starts with the player to the left of the wolf reading out a topic, then the wolf choosing to either squat up with as many as two pack members in larger games or go it alone. Mario. Mm. Oh, snap! <laughs> All before everyone gives their answer. Scores are tracked regardless of who is working together or working solo, and wolf power transfers to the next person until the round is complete. We should note, however, that the instructions were somewhat unclear about the proper breakdown of scores for the included card, so we definitely had to wing it a bit. Trivia ranges from a very broad spectrum of topics, ranging from historical facts, to dog breeds, to classic board games, to the sport of kings itself, NASCAR. So there is a Name decent amount of variety Disney to be found here. Based on the film she starred in, one, The Little Mermaid. While there is a strategic element for the more competitive wolves in the pack, it's nice to see not just a cooperative, but edutainment-based approach, as no doubt people will be learning both unique pop culture facts, as well as solid academic ones if they don't already have familiarity with them. So, will you be adding this to your game kit for family night, or hanging on to this for the next get-together with your friends? Let me know down below. In the pros column, this game features fun, flexible gameplay. There is a wide variety of trivia covered, and it's fairly easy to pick up and play. As for cons, there's possibly a little too wide variety in the questions. And there are no refill packs to expand the set once you've mastered the trivia available. Overall, we give this one four stars out of five. You can check out more reviews at TTPM. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel for new content every day. See you next time.